truck of the depot, the driver rubs his eyes, twice. Awful things only, staring the dead of the moors or in the old house on the hill. Wish I could see the egg crawl down his face, and see him toppling in a puddle of batter for the scramble ahead. She's waiting for me with a smile. Friends, you have nothing to lose but your tracks. Ladies and gentlemen, there is good service. The driver wakes me up by 5.30am. It takes 25 minutes for me to get over my grumbling. I'm no mule, named for someone to stick their spurs in my haunch, hat in hand for the gift of slogging. Stop one at 6.30am. She's been there since 6.25, stalling. Exhausting this, I puff a black column of smoke from my backside. She speeds off. Stop two, rush hour at 7.10am. The wolves descend on my belly. They'd eat their own to fill the space. Good countrymen pitched in a gentleman's one. A noose couldn't hang their heads lower. At 7.30am, I add up all the angles and dolts, the bodies, the tracks, the rails, the screeches, the rats, and get two odious sign curves that would dip you to the point of puking. It goes on like this till the end of the day. Stop one again at 10 to midnight. A prayer couldn't hang my head lower. Hat in hand for the gift of resting. the coin the broken dollar a means of payment at the fatal spill where it all began could i feel the end of a fall or calculate the time it takes from toss to thud to hear the sound of the end of space a tinny ring if the ground is full and the air is punctured through a wallop if the space is free to roam between the cracks looking ahead to the day before the day the spill slips back in at the thought of sleeping late the sun beams a smile so bright it beats an eye in me to spy a future without spin or smudge Two discs with eyes, I count four, sharing a vision of future. No grubby hands, no dizziness, no indigestion, burning guts. But faced with such an opening without a hinge or jaw, when the tilt starts standing up, I cling the shape instead. Park back to when I was a hammer mashing men's skulls to pulp. Bits of me broken down to show the bow the way through the neck. Splintered still into earthenware, trapping heat, killing bugs. From all the making and unmaking wear began to show. So I dug a hole in the ground for fear of that which I'd be whittled to. Deep down there in the bowels of earth, I never met the hell that forging brought. Melted down and brought back to life into a world of things. At first it was glorious to experience this new origin. In place of seeds to sow to eat, I planted a new routine. People were at ease with me, settling their restless hearts. Looking in the mirror, I see anything. Sticky things to smoke and chew. Beautiful things like dolls. Free to circulate around the world like blood giving life. The sight of so many things, all the grease could not keep me from hardening. Now I spin, a trifling token, and free fall while the hideous things abound. Closer to the common man, but we are so far apart. Credit, capital, inflation, debt. Nothing without no more. Used to scrape in softer things, words outliving life. Used to keep the dead from escaping through men's eyes. Used to settle decisions when no other means suffice. I can land in other things. Bags of bones can get to rotting. I can rest assured I'm the only way to be.